Hello, um, the question is baddie or goodie? Well, to be honest, um, the baddie's always more fun, uh, except the problem is no one can hear you because of all the booing. But a lot of fun can be had with the baddie. As for goodies and the clown, yeah, it's all brilliant. I quite enjoy any of that. So the answer is both, really. If I uh, could appear with anyone in Panto uh, from the past, or the future, or both. Uh, I think it would have to be the late, great Les Dawson. I think he's probably one of the classic Panto dames. And of course, my friend, and I think Panto King, uh, Brian Connolly, because I've worked with Brian before, and I've seen his Pantos. And personally, I think he's the best in the business. Uh, Panto for 2020, yes, I, there was one uh, that I really, really wanted to do. Um, I, I was really up for it, but unfortunately it clashed with another job. So I couldn't do it because I said I'd do this other job first. Um, so I went off to do the, uh, the job and of course it all stopped because of COVID. But on the bright side, I'm still available for Panto 2020. On the subject of people from reality TV uh, or celebs or whatever coming in to do panto, I just have two questions. One, can they do the job? Two, will they bring people into the theatre? And if they manage to fulfil both of those, I'm a very happy man indeed. On the uh, question of a, a curly return to Coronation Street, I'm always, always, always asked. And I think it's no secret, yes, I'd like to go back and maybe do some episodes. Um, we're actors, we tell stories, uh, that's what we do. And I think Curly would have a very uh, interesting story to tell. <laughs>